Today marks 100 years since Boston's Great Molasses Flood. So a massive tank burst sending a large amount and a deadly wave of molasses through the city's north end. Eyewitness News reporter Michaela McDonald joining us now with those details. Danielle and Patrick, it happened in the middle of the day exactly 100 years ago in Boston's north end. A giant tank of containing 2.3 million gallons of molasses ruptured, sending a giant wave at least 25 feet high, which is nearly as tall as an NFL goalpost into the street. 21 people were killed and 150 others were injured. While molasses is often thought of as sticky and slow, according to reports, the first wave of molasses raced through the neighborhood at 35 miles per hour. 100 years later, the Great Molasses Flood is captivating unprecedented public attention, according to the Friends of the Boston Harbor Walk. When you hear of this enormous wave of molasses that literally smothered people who were in the immediate vicinity, and it's odd that it sort of disappeared from memory. And a small plaque marks the spot of the tragedy, but now a new sign will be placed where the giant tank of molasses once stood. Michaela McDonald, Eyewitness News.